Welcome to the sixth arrondissement of Paris. This is the part of Paris that you probably think about uh, when you're planning your trip to Paris. This is where the writers and the philosophers used to hang out on cafe terraces. Yeah, the intellectuals. Full of museums, full of uh, beautiful scenery like this Place de Fustenburg behind us and the Delacroix Museum. But first, we're going to start off with a coffee in a famous coffee shop. Let's do it. simplest taste. I'm satisfied with the best. They're the words of Oscar Wilde who was staying in this hotel behind me when he died in 1900. The hotel is simply called L'Hotel, the hotel. And I've heard that they've uh, made his suite into quite a special place indeed. I'm going to see if I can take a look at it. Let's check it out. was staying here in this very room uh, at the end of his life. Uh, really beautiful room though, uh, up to a thousand euros if you want to take it for yourself. The walls are covered in sort of Oscar Wilde memorabilia. There's some letters up there. Uh, this sort of green decorative peacock work on the walls. Super impressive uh, and it's got its own little private terrace outside. Uh, if you're an Oscar Wilde fan, this is the place for you. Excited right now because this is the obsession that brought me to Paris. La durée. Yes. <laughs> uh, podcast listeners know what we're talking about. The story from uh, the debutante divorcee. But from sight. We won't get into it now, but uh, this is essentially why Lena is in yeah, Paris. I'm not ashamed. Let's get inside and have a look. Let's do it. Nice 
night has fallen in Paris. And we got a babysitter! <laughs> it's actually 7 p.m. now, but it's still really bright. Yeah. Uh, we're sitting outside Le Select, famous old cafe brasserie. And it's directly across from La Coupole in the 14th, which we visited, uh, well, weeks ago. I guess eight weeks ago, would it be? Uh, time uh, flies. Time for a drink before dinner. As Charles Aznavour, who lived in this district, once said, take me to the edge of the earth. Instead, Lena has suggested taking me for, des <laughs> for dessert at La Perouse, yeah. which I'll settle for. It's uh, centuries old, it's famous for loads of reasons. And it's just right here. So that's what we're gonna do to round out the night. Join us for dessert. We'll see you next week in the fifth hour of this month. Bye. Au revoir.